Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to do these very easy but eye-catching dishcloths. I have two dishcloths here that are done using the same pattern but different yarns. I used variegated yarn for this one here and for this one I used two different yarns to make the two stripes. But in both cases, it is the exact same stitch pattern. I am going to show a sample of this dishcloth in this video uh, to keep it short. But the entire free pattern is available on my website hookthatthread.com. I'll put a link in the description below and also in the comments. Alright, so for this dishcloth, I'm using a cotton yarn and 5mm hook. We are going to start this dishcloth by making chains. Here I'm going to make 11 chains. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so I have 11 chains here. Now for the first row, we are going to start by making a half double crochet in the second chain from the hook, but in the back bump of that chain. So yarn over, insert the hook under that back bump, yarn over, pull it through, three loops on the hook, yarn over again, pull through all three loops on the hook. That's your first half double crochet. Okay, let's do one more. Yarn over, insert the hook under the back bump of the next chain, pull the yarn through, yarn over, pull through all three. This is your second half double crochet. We're going to keep doing that in each of these chains uh, till the end of this row and I'll meet you at the end. Here we just finished making half double crochet stitches in each of the chains. For the next row, we are going to chain 1 and turn around your work. For this row, we are going to make a half double crochet in the first stitch here. So let's go ahead and do that. For the next stitch, we are going to do half double crochet but by inserting the hook under the front loop of that uh, top of the stitch. So not under both the loops, just the front loop. So yarn over, insert the hook under the front loop only like this. Yarn over and pull it through and finish up the half double crochet as usual. For the next stitch, we are going to insert the hook under the back loop only of that stitch so this one here right there so let's yarn over insert the hook under the back loop only yarn over pull it through and then pull through all three loops now we are going to continue repeating this pattern uh, for the rest of the row so next one is going to be front loop only half double crochet so let's go ahead and do that and the one after that is going to be back loop only half double crochet all right let's keep doing this till the end of the row and i'll show you what needs to be done in the final stitch the turning chain of this row okay here we are at the end of the uh, row two um, we have one stitch that's remaining that's the turning chain we are going to do a regular half double crochet in here so insert the hook under both the loops uh, and finish up the half double crochet as usual we are going to continue this repeating this uh, second row uh, for the rest of the dishcloth so chain one and then we are going to turn around the work and then in the first stitch we are going to do regular half double crochet just like we did it in the uh, second row and then uh, followed by front loop half double crochet and back loop half double crochet and ending the row uh, with the uh, regular half double crochet okay here i'm at the end of the row 
three we are going to keep repeating this row two as many times as uh, we want to make the dish cloth for both these uh, dish cloths i use the same exact pattern if you want stripes you just will change the yarn and join another yarn and do the same pattern again again both the patterns for both these dish cloths are available on my website hookthatthread.com uh, i hope you enjoyed this video uh, please let me know in the comments below uh, thank you very much for watching see you next time bye